All right. The bop blues, we call it. We're getting into the jazz for a little bit in this one in the course. Uh, we're nearing the end of the course, and I want to introduce a few new elements. One of them is the six chord. Now, this is not just a three chord blues, but it's only five chords. It's got a couple new tricks in it. The two five uh, chord progression we learned in the last lesson, and we're adding one more, the six chord. We can get into this detail there. This is in the style of thousands of actually jazz songs in the in the 40s and 50s. Um, so it's not of any particular artist. Um, but you will come across this if you're in a jam and they decide to do a blues. It might be this jazzy side of the blues um, sometimes, and especially if it's a jazz jam. They'll throw in these couple extra chords. And I'll show you all about that in the chord lessons below and the bass line lesson. We got the melody. We got leading tones down there to, for you to learn from. Um, we'll talk a little bit about playing this in third position, different things, a little more challenging than other ones. Um, the melody to it's only five notes. The whole melody is only five notes. So it's a pretty easy melody, although it's in an odd key for us fiddlers, it's in B flat. I want to do one in an odd key like this because um, jazz like this is primarily in the horn world. And horn instruments, as you know, aren't in the same key as us. What does that mean? It's a weird thing. I know I don't, historically I'm not sure how this developed, but if you tell a tenor sax player to play a C that they've learned as a C, it'll come out as our B flat. So everything's one step off. Same thing uh, for soprano sax, um, trumpet, clarinet, and other, other instruments are different, even E flat. There's, the alto sax is an E flat. So they have a lot of these flatted keys. So we should step their direction a little bit without retuning you might be good for you to learn how to jam in the key of B flat so you can fit in with horn players who they're pretending that they're playing in C themselves. It's like not fair. But um, we can, if we get strong enough as a, as a pack, as a tribe, maybe we can make all them bend to our familiar keys. But I'm going to teach you one that's in the key of B flat. So you got B flat blues, it's going to be half position or third position, and some new things. And hopefully this will round out your education in the blues before we tie it together at the end. All right, so enjoy, and uh, if you're not taking the course yet, consider it. It's still open for sale, and you get lifetime access, um, and before I close the sales of it for a while, I'm going to close the vault. You, if you purchase it, will always have access to it, um, but I'm going to put it away as far as the store goes for a while so I can focus on other things. Um, but check it out. It's a pretty complete lesson. I'm pretty proud of it, and it's good, good for your educationally. So see you in the lessons below.